Hello students welcome to my channel today we are going to do science ncert keywords for class 6 chapter number 9 the living organisms characteristics and habitats but before starting let me tell you please subscribe to my channel our first keyword is adaptation the presence of specific features and habits which enable a plant or an animal to live in a particular habitat is called adaptation for example cactus are adapted to say to survive in desert because they have some specific features in their body that enable them to survive in a particular habitat our next keyword is aquatic habitat the habitat of plants and animals that live in water are called aquatic habitat example ponds rivers lakes oceans are some of the examples of the aquatic habitat some animals like fish or then dolphins etc live in the aquatic habitat our next keyword is biotic component the living things such as plants and animals are called biotic components for example plant and the animals they are considered in the as a biotic component our next keyword is excretion the process by which organisms get rid themselves of the waste products generating in their body is known as excretion so we can say that remove the process of removal of waste from their body that process is called the excretion our next keyword is growth the process by which living organism move from one stage to another in their life is called growth as you can see in this figure the first the seed develops into the plant step by step that process is called the growth so all the living organism whether is an animal or plant they move from one stage to another in their life is called the growth the our next keyword is habitat the surroundings where the plants and animals live is called their habitat our next keyword is living organisms that show the sign of life in them are called the living or we can say the next definition would be the process of being alive by performing some activities like respiration growth excretion etc is called living so we can say living means any organisms that is having some life in them they are called the living and they can perform the various functions like respiration all the living organism characteristics like growth respiration then excretion reproduction etc our next keyword is reproduction the process by which living things produce more of their own kind is known as reproduction for example here in the figure it is given hen gives eggs and from that chicken grows and then it converts into the hen so that whole process of any living organism that produce the more of their own kind or we can say that they produce their offspring that process is called the reproduction next keyword is respiration the process of breathing is called respiration the process or we can say the next definition would be the process of exchange of gases by an organism from its environment is called respiration for example human beings take in oxygen and release the carbon dioxide so there is exchange of gases in the organism from its environment 
that process is called the respiration our next keyword is stimulus so an action that invokes some kind of reaction in response from an organism is called stimulus for example when you are hungry you eat some food or a rabbit gets scared when you go uh, through uh, towards them towards the rabbit it gets scared and it runs away so stimulus means an action that invokes some kind of reaction in response from an organism is called the stimulus so this is where the keywords of chapter number 9 i hope you have understood and noted down in your book if you have any doubt you can ask me in the comment section and for that you have to subscribe to my channel and if you have liked my video please like the video and uh, subscribe to my channel for the latest videos